Good morning guys, so first up let me apologise for my absence over the last few weeks. I said I wasn't going to do any more disappearing acts and I did, um, but all with valid reason. I promise this last few weeks have just been something else. Um, I feel like this whole year has just been <laughs> the worst, but the last few weeks in particular have just like... <laughs> me over um they've not been fun at all um for various reasons loads that i'm just not even gonna get into but you probably will have seen on social media as well that a couple of weeks ago at my brother's wedding um our car was stolen <laughs> our car was stolen which when you've had like when you've gone through the stuff we've gone through this year that was just like just one more thing, you know? It was just one more thing. This year, I've definitely struggled, but I feel like this last few weeks, anxiety has <laughs> popped its little head up again. Um, but I woke up this morning and I was like, do you know what? Regardless of how I've woken up feeling, I'm gonna chuck on some makeup, do my hair, and vlog, because vlogging's what I love doing. Um, and actually, I've got a really busy day, so it makes sense to vlog. Um, so, the kids have just been dropped off at school. Mike and I have got to head out in a minute to go and pay for Everly's birthday party venue. I've got to pick up a couple of bits. Um, it's school disco day today, which obviously, um, well, not obviously, I have had all the school stuff. So that's what I'm going to be doing this evening. Uh, loads and loads of stuff in and around the house that need doing. So come along with me, grab a cup of tea because it might be a long one. I said that I probably think this is probably going to be a really short one, um, but yeah, stick with me. I just realised I just assumed that you guys followed me over on Instagram. If you don't, then please do. Um, but if you don't, then you won't actually know the car drama. We do have the car back. We found the car. Um, basically, when we realised the car had been stolen, um, we went on a huge <laughs> social media hunt to find the car. I knew that it was going to be dumped somewhere like locally. That's what like car thieves do now apparently um so we went on a huge social media like thing to find the car my instagram was a wild time um mike went out looking for it i went out looking for it it was like a dog of a bone like that i literally won't give up like i would not have stopped until we found that car and searched for hours and hours and hours and hours on the sunday then we had a message from a lovely follower on instagram saying that she'd seen the car um, and was actually only four minutes away from there at that point um, so we whizzed round, found the car which was like the most amazing moment um, do you know what, I'm going to pop in a clip of I think a story that I did when we found it um, now guys we found it, well I didn't find it the most amazing lady on here, she found my car um, in the middle of nowhere as I expected it would be but she found it and I'm so so grateful like beyond grateful I owe her so much um but social media worked and all of your shares and stuff worked so thank you thank you thank you so grateful um I can't breathe. yeah we found the car yes it was ripped to pieces and just a nightmare but we found the car which is great however now we're in like the aftermath of really fun life admin and insurance claims and police stuff which is a joy i actually find it really like mind-blowing one the car was stolen to begin with but two um like the circumstances that we found it like what a story Alexa, turn Evelyn's lamp off so we've just been to see the venue it's so cute and pick up harrison's christmas jumper um, for school and what else have we got to get? Yeah. Oh, stuff for Air Fryer Friday. I'm looking for some candlestick holders. <coughs> Hello. I love this. I had loads of questions about my one last year and Sainsbury's have exactly the same at the moment. So rather than party bags at Effie's party, I have got every child one of these and some bubbles 
bag and I'm going to wrap them up and keep. That's quite a nice idea, they're like a pound each. Um, yeah, I like that idea. I won't take the credit that it was my mum's idea. Um, I'm just now looking for candy necklaces. So we've just come out of Sainsbury's, Mike's actually just gone back in because he forgot something. Um, but that was successful, I managed to get a few more bits for the kids for their advent calendars. Um, and then one of the little like plasticky rubbish toys <laughs> that Everly had her eye on uh, for her birthday I think. It was on two for £15, that's a bargain, I'm pleased with that. It's now like half twelve I think, um, so we're going to go home. Make some lunch, film Air Fryer Friday. We missed, we missed last week's, so yeah, which is really annoying. Yeah. And I need to, what else do I need to do at home? You know, you just feel like I had so much to do, and now I can't remember any of it. I need to get the tree down from the loft, so that when the kids are back from their school discos, we can put it up. That's my phone, I bet that's Mike. No, it's not. <laughs> that's Mike. Hello. I wonder if Mike will be on board with getting a little cheeky Starbucks. I didn't like to steer off of, a, not a plan as such. If I just say like, I don't know, we're going to go and look at the venue, pay for it, then go to Sainsbury's. That's all he thinks he's doing. <laughs> if I go out, I'm like, oh yeah, I need to go to that venue and Sainsbury's. And whilst I'm at Sainsbury's, I might pop over to Hobbycraft because they might have da 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 da. And whilst I'm there, I might as well go to Starbucks. Um... You know? <laughs> no, if I said to him now, oh, let's pop over to Hobbycraft, he'd be like... Oh, that's so cute. They are much smaller than I thought they would be. Oh, that's so annoying. Wait, do you think these plates are going to be too small for kids? These plates. So these are the little fun locket things that I got in Tesco and then I got a little what they squish fill thing for the advent calendar anything else what where's the other little thing I'll show you what I'm going to put into the advent calendar maybe I can do them tonight when they're in bed I've got five the advent calendar actually We've just got in from the school disco. Um, I had both of the kids. I don't know if I said that. I had both of the kids school discos tonight. And you know what? I really need this cup of tea. You teachers out there, teachers, lunchtime supervisors, anyone that works in that capacity, hats off to you because that's a lot of children. Still got loads to do. I had loads on my list to do today, didn't I? And then when we got back from Sainsbury's, we really forgot that we had an appointment booked here, um, and literally until the door knocked. And then we were like, damn it. So we didn't actually get to do anything that I needed to do. Um, and then I had to shoot off to the school. So this evening's going to be busy, which is a little bit annoying. But I thought, let me sit down for 10 minutes, have a cup of tea, and then I can get going again. I've got to go up into the loft, find the advent calendar. Um, I need to find. Nice to say. Yes. Yes. Was it fun? So fun. <laughs> I'm up in the loft and it is so cold up here. Oh my goodness. Look at I've seen these on my Instagram. I am quite obsessed. Might think they're the most ridiculous thing in the world, but um, I love them. It's Thursday, it's December now. Um, Tinsel the Earth came this morning. It's been a kind of busy one over here. Um, Finishing up some of the stuff I was meant to have done yesterday that we didn't manage to get done. I had an appointment first thing this morning, so I need to do some picking up in the house because you know what it's like. Well, actually, maybe you don't. Maybe it's just my house, but in the morning, things get a little bit chaotic. 
I get a little bit chaotic. I don't know why my belly's rumbling. <laughs> I'm really not hungry. I've just had quite a substantial breakfast at the garden centre with Mike. I popped into the garden centre because I need to get some Christmas lights. And they're all half price. So, yeah, you know I love. I love to be a little fairy light. I picked up these berry lights. I've never had berry lights. Um, but I've been keen to. So I picked these ones up. I think these are, uh, yeah, are these the... Well, these are the battery ones. Um, I've got some micro wire clusters uh, because I thought they might look quite cute on the fireplace. Um, some more berry light. Um, and then some new tree lights because the lights I put on the tree yesterday, I'm sure I've always had warm white, but they look quite bright. Um, so I picked these up and then I can return them if they are. But I then picked up one of these fast cuts, which I've seen online. I looked on Amazon, but they were like $9.99 online. Um, so I got this, this was $2.99. Then some more hot chocolate. I also bought these little decorations um, a while ago now, but I thought I'd show you them. Now it's time to actually put some up. I've got this lovely star. I think that is so pretty. I absolutely love i missed out on the ones in h&m um but these are gorgeous i'm really really happy with those i did actually get these ones in h&m which i think are lovely um last christmas i remember saying i'm gonna get a new tree next year um but i feel like it's just not a priority like they're so expensive as well um, our tree is old, like, we've had it since we, since Harrison's first Christmas, so it's like eight, nearly nine years old. This gorgeous gift from Neon, let me open it and show you, I wish like, I wish you could smell how this smells, it's just my favourite, um, there's so many goodies in here, but what I wanted to get out was the new Christmas candle because I can put it out now and um, now the tree's out this is perfect piece honestly it's so good I think you tend to forget like what you've got in your stash don't you but one little tip I've got is all the little bits that break off hold on to these because these are so great for like table settings so I've just done this little setup here I've got my little star out that comes out every year we normally do two but I think I'm going to keep it at one, um, and I'm really happy. I am an artist. Do you know? I am a three, and I draw a lot. Hey! Jeez! <laughs> this yeah. drawing? Yes, Mummy! Christmas movie, Father Christmas pants fall down. They did fall down. Evelyn and I are just watching Miracle on 34th Street, which is my favourite children. Well, is it my favourite Christmas movie ever? It's certainly my favourite as a child. Like, I watched it over and over and over and over again. I think it was because I loved... I'm going to call her Matilda. And that's why you like it, I think, isn't it? And it's because his pants fall down. <laughs> because his pants fall down is why you like the movie. Yeah. You're a donut. I keep rewinding it to the so bum. Cute. The boys are just at football, so we're just having some chill time. You just had your meatballs, <sighs> haven't you? It was delicious. I left it. Oh, I've got something in my pocket for you. Do you know what is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, where did you get out of <laughs> A nice treat. Did you did you have fun for Harrison? Oh, that's really kind that you're thinking of Harrison. Yeah, I do. I thought he didn't because if he didn't, I, 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 I would keep him for Harrison. That's so kind of you. I was doing some filming upstairs earlier on and I came downstairs and there was a few little decorations on the tree. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six little decorations. Do you know how they got there? I <laughs> put them under. Yeah. 
she said she just could not help herself um so i don't know whether i think a few more probably will end up on there mommy put some on there i did but only so they didn't fall off the shelf we're gonna do our proper decorating tomorrow aren't we this is our view right now and it is so cozy i love it so much <laughs> <laughs> 